All right, folks, I am cruising to my buddy Thomas's house who has not just one Super 73 bike, he has two Super 73s now, and he's gonna let me ride it today. I've already ridden it once. Go to the upper right-hand corner, click on that vlog, and you will see my initial gut reaction to the first time I hopped on one of these incredible electric bikes. It's just out of the, out of out of control. It's out of control. So here we go. We're almost at Thomas's house, and it's just gonna be so fun to like be able to ride two at once. This thing's great. <laughs> I, I, I like the grip. The tire tread is spot on on this guy. This is the Super 73 S in, I'll just call it Army Green. I like it, man. Woo! It it's, does good and off-road. It's fun, huh? It does good and off-road, Super yeah. fun, yeah. Oh, you're kicking it. You're tearing it up so out I there. I trying not to hit a tree. Yeah, <laughs> that hurt. You know? Oh, man. In three months, have you had any issues with the Super 73? Like any breakdowns or anything? Or how long have you had the Rose, the first one? I've had one? the Rose since January. Since January? No, February. February. Okay, and no, pretty much no issues? No issues. Um, Brake squeaking here and there, and then you just adjust it. Yeah. Um, maybe a little bit of oil on the chain. Yep. Wipe it down. Charge the battery. But the but, pretty much it. But like the batteries are good. Batteries are bomb. Batteries are good, folks. Like that would worry me the most if I was looking into buying a super set. Like how long will the bat? Because they are powerful, and when you're throttling all the time, I would think that the battery would wear out over. You know, and I know they. I think they have something like fifteen hundred to two thousand charge. Okay. Before they start any issues, like they're rated for something like that. Thou it's in the thousands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. And I've only charged it maybe 10, 15 times. Yep. You know, 20 times. Yep. Most. So I don't charge it every day. It's like once a week or maybe once every three days. Yeah. Depending on how much I'm riding around the neighborhood or yep. demo rides for people or taking my friends out. And now the Rose gets 40 miles range on one battery charge. That's awesome. 40 miles? I mean, if you're in a city especially, like, oh, yeah. you can go 40 miles, like, that's a long ways. And that's now, a how, week's worth of riding. And how about the S? How far, what's the battery on that guy? 25, 30 miles, depending on how much you're helping it out. Okay. Uh, but it's the same motor. Yep. Um, so you get the same speed. Yeah. Um, it's got the same power, you know, as you're taking off, it feels like you're on that one. Yeah. And essentially, it may even go faster because you have less weight. Sure. There's less battery weight. There's less framework weight. Yep. That's a good point. So, you know, it might go quicker off the start, you know, depending. Mm-hmm. But I, I think it's very, I, I think they're equivalent. And in fact, I really dig the wider looking, the look of the uh, the more aggressive tires versus the, the roses. These are more kind of sure. like street off-road, if you will. Yep. Versus, these are more like dirt bike tires. Well, I rode, I rode the Rose uh, three or four months ago and it doesn't feel different at all. As far as power, as far as even the braking, the, how it handles, 
even the tread on, I mean, it just doesn't, it doesn't feel any That's different. How many miles it has on it. And he's put on 370 miles on this guy. So that ain't bad. Uh, and there's guys that are, have thousand easy on yeah. these already. Yeah, yeah. Um, and today we just did a little five mile ride. Five mile? Wow. That's amazing. Like I felt like it was... We went there, there. Yeah, I guess we did. So we just did five miles on this guy and um, it just was... Yeah, it's as like easy as pie. Yeah, it's got some, it's got power. We're going up hills and grass.